top 10 places to visit in Toronto in 2023. Toronto's slogan is not go big or go home, but this statement is a good summary of their major attractions. CN Tower offers seven wonders of the new world. Visit the Art Gallery of Ontario to view 90,000 works of art. Other great places include the Royal Ontario Museum and Ripley's Aquarium of Canada. Get ready for this ecstasy! Number 10. CN Tower One of the seven wonders of the new world, this iconic building is Toronto's model of Paris's Eiffel Tower. It allows visitors to catch breathtaking panoramic views from the restaurants and all observation areas. Beyond being a cool building, visitors can take an elevator up to the revolving 360 restaurant for some world-class dining. Make sure you walk across the glass floor, about 2.5 inches thick and 113 stories above the ground. For visitors that want an even bigger thrill, they can travel up another 33 stories to the Skypod Lookout. Number 9. Royal Ontario Museum This is the largest museum of world cultures and natural history in Canada. Found right in downtown Toronto, the main entrance to the museum, known as the Crystal, will draw you in right away. As visitors walk from floor to floor past the 25-meter totem pole, they have the opportunity to encounter art, archaeology, history, zoology, and any other you could possibly imagine. With something new to find every time you visit, the 100-year-old museum is a good spot for locals and tourists alike. Number 8. Ripley's Aquarium of Canada This spot offers you the opportunity of coming face-to-face -face with a shark and separated only by a pane of glass. The Ripley's Aquarium of Canada allows visitors to live that ocean experience while exposing them to about 16,000 marine animals hosted on site. Visitors can explore life on the reef and also walk in safely under a dangerous lagoon, stick their heads in an underwater viewing bubble, or having a stingray dive show. Number 7. Distillery District here, visitors can explore the restaurants, art boutiques, and entertainment. This pedestrian-only village consists of more than 40 heritage buildings that house everything a modern traveler would enjoy. Modern fashion can be found in the restored Victorian-era buildings. In this building, culinary inventions are often hidden behind weathered brick walls. Visitors can experience and view the wooden stalls while getting themselves and their loved ones some gift items. After a tiring day of shopping, visitors are allowed to indulge in outdoor dining at any of the restaurants that offer delicious food. Number 6. Art Gallery of Ontario Visit to view the 90,000 works of art live on the walls of the Art Gallery of Ontario, one of the largest and best museums in North America. Discover the beautiful work of Canada's Group of Seven Art Collective, then travel the globe from the African art gallery to European collections, and travel back in time, from the Renaissance eras to the present day. Even the building is a creative work of art. If anyone loves art, there's no better place in the city to be. Make sure you subscribe to this channel and give this video a like if you are enjoying the content. Number 5. Casa Loma Believe it or not, this is the only full-sized castle in North America. Visitors are allowed to experience the turrets offering beautiful views of the city. Visit the large library, and if you have enough time, there are 100 rooms to explore. Walk through the secret passageways, which include a 245-meter tunnel to the stables and carriage house. Plus, it is five acres of gardens, and you can take pictures close to the beautiful flowers, fountains, and sculptures. Plug in your headphones and make sure you listen to the digital audio guide. Number 4. Hockey Hall of Fame If you've never witnessed a game before, you will have to pay a visit to the Hockey Hall of Fame. Visitors get the chance of learning about the 388 members that are inducted into the Hall of Fame, and view the sticks, pucks, gloves, and even the nets from some of the greatest games ever played. You can also test your shooting and goalie ability with the state-of-the-art games. Know if you can make it as a play-by-play -play commentator and get a seat in the replica NHL dressing room. Don't forget to touch the actual Stanley Cup. Number 3. The Toronto International Film Festival TIFF turns the whole city into a 10-day party, 
during which viewers can screen cutting-edge cinema, meet celebrities and filmmakers, or just enjoy the celebration as a whole community. Even if you're not present in Toronto during the September festival, it has a year-round presence that offers a lot. Make sure you visit the new TIFF Bell Lightbox for the screenings of classic cinema and contemporary arthouse movies. You can also participate in a film-focused lecture or workshop, or see where cinema and visual art intersect at a TIFF exhibition. Number 2. The Toronto Islands Hop on a ferry and begin a journey to the Toronto Islands. This is an attraction-filled destination where relaxation is available to all visitors. There are no cars, so visitors will rent a bike or rollerblades to explore the chain of islands. The maze on the island serves to test every visitor's wit, while the haunted lighthouse tests their courage. From chilling picnics to ponies to paddle boats, Toronto Islands is a place to be. Number 1. St. Lawrence Market Treat your senses right, as you see, smell, and sample fresh produce and cheese in the same place. The vendors here have been selling it for more than two centuries. All of that history is found in a small, more depth during a walking tour of the complex, which also features venues for business and social events, and many local artisans selling clothing, souvenirs, jewelry, and more. Visitors check it out from Tuesdays to Saturdays.